Hello Cloudy family! I hope you are all doing well. So today is gonna be another clean with me and it's sort of gonna be late on night. I also don't know if I'll get everything done today but I will try. Um, not really feeling it but I do need to get the place like pretty cleaned up. That's what we're gonna do today and I hope you enjoy it. So let's get going! Since we have a lot of cleaning to do today, I figured I would write it out on a list because it's such a great way to motivate myself to keep going because every time I check off something, it just is so satisfying to know that that little thing is done. So that's a great tip for anybody who is like me who sometimes doesn't really like to clean. Just write it down on the list and just keep marking it off because little by little, you'll be done. Sweet! Now that the balcony is all done, I can go ahead and cross off all the things that I had underneath it. But that doesn't mean I can relax because there's so much more to do. Okay, hear me out. I don't always let go of my place this badly. It's just lately I've been in this mood where I just can't get out of it and I am always feel like I have a dark cloud above me. I'm not usually the happy cloud, but the dark cloud who doesn't want to do anything. So I'm so sorry for this, but it is what it is, you know. Sometimes I get into these kind of moods and I know I'm not the only one. so very easily entertained. Surprisingly, this part was very easy. All I had to do for my stove was wipe off that extra food and with a wet sponge and some method I cleaned it up and lastly with a microfiber cloth I just dried it up and made it look pretty. So I was very happy. Let's see what's in the fridge. Oh, that does not look appealing at all. Why don't we go ahead and fix that? Much better. After some hard work and dedication and elbow grease, we are finally done! Yay! Look at that kitchen! Oh my goodness! You wouldn't think it's the same kitchen, would you? Now that we had a break, we can go ahead and tackle the dining room. And this was a mess because I was recording my Samurai Champloo journaling video and this is the harsh reality of journaling. It gets so messy all the time.
Luckily, this did not take that long at all. It was such an easy cleanup and I was really impressed. I was like, wow, I thought this was gonna take way longer. And as for my fireplace, I didn't really need to clean it that much since I don't really burn wood. All I really do is light candles, well, fake candles. I just wanted to give it a light dusting. Okay, I know this looks weird, but I always have to flatten down the couch cushions because it always bumps up in the middle and I hate when it does that. So just in case you were wondering, that's why I'm giving CPR to them. I feel like we are chugging along quite well. Look at all those check marks. So satisfying. We are actually doing very well. Look at how much stuff we already checked off and with only five rooms left. The entryway is probably one of my favorites to clean because it's just so fast and easy. There really isn't much to clean up. It's just putting away a couple things and just dusting off all my knickknacks and my matroshki. I'm not gonna lie, every time I see that photo, I regret cutting my hair. But I know if I never cut my hair, I would have been wondering all my life how I would have looked with really short hair. For the bedroom, I feel like the easiest thing for me to do was to just collect all the clothes and shoes and put them away. Now that all the little things are put away, I can go ahead and take off the sheets so I can go ahead and give them a good wash. I'm not gonna lie, but making the bed was a huge mistake because it was so hard for me to stay awake. So I decided to do the rest the next day. There was quite a bit of things to dust because I haven't done it in a while so I wanted to take my time and make sure that I got every bit of dust. And just like that, my bedroom has become a cozy oasis. Oh, it looks so good. I'm so proud of myself. You might have realized, but my office looks a bit different compared to my newer videos and that's because this video was recorded a long time ago. I just never really had the chance to edit this because it had so much clips that I needed to go through and I wanted to try to do a really good job for you guys.
Compared to the other rooms, my office did not take that long at all and I think it's because I haven't really been spending that much time in it. So luckily, that was good news for me. Moving on, we're gonna go ahead and tackle the guest bathroom, and it shouldn't take too long since it's a small room. Nani? Yay, toilet scrubbing. So fun. I hope you guys don't mind, but since the bathrooms were sort of self-explanatory and not that interesting to look at, I just went ahead and cleaned up the master bathroom really quickly, and these are the results. Oh my goodness, we are so close to finishing! Can you believe it? All we have to do is the laundry, vacuuming, and mop, which is totally easy. And just like that, it is time for the final reveal. I can't believe it took two days to clean up the place, however, it was totally worth it because it looks nothing like the beginning, and I am so proud of myself for finally getting up and cleaning around. I also want to thank you guys for sticking around, I know this was a long video, and if you enjoyed it, consider joining the Cloudy Fam, I upload once or twice a week, and I like to make a variety of videos. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!